morning. I have a couple projects today that I want to get done. One of which is to get the chicks out into the coop, into their new pen boarding section, whatever you want to call it. Yes, they were out there to begin with. I had them in their little tub heat lamp, but it was kind of cooler that day. We had breezes and I just felt they were going to be too stressed out there. And I wanted to keep better track of them, you know, especially the first few days. So they got to come into the house. Kids were thrilled, however, because of course they got little baby cheekies in the house, but they need to move out. They are noisy and stinky. They, they just need to go out to their coop where they belong. But to do that, I have to build a new section, a boarding section, broader, I think is what it's called, something like that, uh, for them, which A, will be bigger, and they need bigger, more room, because what they're in right now is not big enough for as many as we have, and it's easier doing this than just splitting them out into two tubs. They can at least be all together still. However, I will need to get boards, uh, ready and as you remember these boards that i hauled over here a while back i'm gonna use those i have to take them apart and then haul them over to the coop and then we'll begin assembling it and doing what we need to do which means power tools one of which i have used before the other one i have not used before i've watched tubby use it but i've not actually gotten to use it so that could be interesting but before we can even get to that point i have to get these boards taken apart and then we'll have to get them hauled over so stay tuned <laughs> So I already have a load that's over there. So I'm gonna carry this load over. I have a small load here in the yard. And then we'll kind of start measuring things up and go from there, see if I need more or if I have plenty. I don't wanna do too many, but we'll see. We'll get this stuff hauled over, so stay tuned. So we're over here. I already had a few boards cut. I just have one more to cut and then we'll go from there on measuring and seeing how many I'll actually need to be able to make it. And we might just nail it together and then cut the edges off because I probably I was like debating. The ends have these nails and it's like I could try to nail them, you know, knock them down or I could just build it and then go through and just cut those off, which I think would probably be best. We'll see. We're going to get this one cut so then I can work at measuring and seeing how many I have and what I'm going to need and what it's going to take. So stay tuned. Looking for change, looking for pain, pulling a mob, pushing a train. I'll never stop, stick to a lane, pick up the pieces and go rearrange. I'll be the best above all the rest, but me to the top. Uh, for sure of the long ones. We'll see about the short ones because some of those uh, ended up cracked, but maybe I'll have enough uh, extra longer ones to use to do the sides. And actually the long ones don't have nails in them, so I won't actually have to cut anything off of them. I just need to uh, nail them onto the wood. What I'm going to do is I'll do one wall, get it all nailed together, do the other long wall, get it nailed together. We'll take it inside. Hmm. Well, A, I think it's going to be heavy by the time I'm done. <laughs> and I don't want it to fall apart. And then I can just cut in there the edges for the other piece. First, we're gonna get this nail together. Now that's the power tool I've never used before. I've never used the air gun, nailer, air nailer, rod nailer, whatever you wanna call it. I've never used it. I've watched Tubby use it. I've not actually done it myself. A little nervous. I gotta get these things lined up well, hook up my air compressor, grab my air nailer. Expect nothing less, you check as I'm chess, what's happening next? Yeah. He got the venom, a tangible weapon, no coming in second, this life is a lesson. He got a new engine from pain, it's a blessing, new focus, no guessing, just bold an obsession. All in his possession, you got the retention, I leave an impression and take a redemption. Just kill no discretion, your mind is a weapon, 11, 11, it's time for progression. Oh! You could try to play, but you never gonna be me, look the other way, what I'm doing. Alright, we're moving inside now, is that we got the two side walls done, now we have to do the two outer ones. The long walls and have to do the short wall. I have my little helper in here. He's holding walls up for me because now I gotta 
do one side of the wall, spin it around and do, or slide it out and do the other. It's like, I forgot about, in fact, I'm gonna have to be able to stand it and nail the walls up. I could always turn it, but I gotta bring it in here anyway, so I can work in here now. And windy, and windy, windy. Okay, actually, yeah, what I think I'm gonna do, I'm gonna die something. I'm gonna die something. I'm windy, because it's windy. Or big wind. Bloody hands stain from the people who deceive me. Muddy hands break through the chains, go free me. People like sheep move feet, hurt it easy. You don't wanna be fast asleep when they see me. Better stand tall, ready for a fight, believe me. When they drag the chains, you can say no, free me. So he's been looking for somebody who could save him Instead of searching inside for what they gave him A strong will, strong mind causes mayhem We could change the world, change times, rearrange them Staying on pace, running the race Life is a chase, I don't want a place I want to be first, work till it hurts Dehydrated thirst till I'm in a hearse oh. High ambitions in the right mind can take you so far It's like you lived a few lifetimes Take off from a break, off from the weak minds They can stay soft, you can change lives, you create thoughts Never waste time, you got one shot, you got one life Better pop off Alright, so I want to say we're done I mean, we still have, I guess we're not done <laughs> I'll take that back We're not done um, I do need to grab the ladder, restaple some things up there Because our paper stuff came down So it causes it to draft through and yes we have other places that it does draft but you do need some air to circulate i gotta grab some chicken wire to put over the top of it some bedding for them grab chicken water my bigger one so they have a bigger water now their feed dishes and then we will then grab them and bring them out so stay tuned i got to well, i gotta pull everything out go grab my heat lamp all that fun stuff okay so i decided just to do the papers up there real quick off camera just because it's hard to maneuver the ladder around and the camera so it's like I'll just do it this way but it's all stapled up that I can get I just need to hook up their heat lamp and then put little furry butts in their new house yes I did tell them they'll be evicted from the main house it was time for them to fly the coop all right, but I gotta get this tied up, but I need two hands to do it, and then we'll get chicks, so stay tuned. I wanna be the best in the game, invest in my name. Check no restraints, I'm obsessed with the pain. I ingest, I retain, assess and I change. Possessed by the thought I'll be free one day from society's restraints. Money, clout and fame, mud disease, a plague. We all love to hate, have to play the game, have to make a name. All our insecurities are on this display. Is Got them all in their new house. We'll see what they think in their new digs. Hopefully they like it better and have more room to roam around. Even though they're all bunched together right now in one little spot, they do like the extra space, I think, I hope. But I think that's where we're gonna leave today's video. I know I needed a few more things done, but the day's getting away from me and I have, I'll have more chores later. Of course, you know, it's, they'll still wait for me. If you like this video, click that like button. If you haven't already, click that subscribe button. And don't forget to ring that bell to get all the notifications when we upload a video. Thanks for watching, bye.